What's up, everyone? Happy Sunday fun day. You didn't think I forgot about you. Everyone's reaching out to me saying, where's your live? Where's your live? I appreciate that. Slapped on the podcast, scrolled some. All right, any better? Can you hear me now? I feel like the Verizon guy. Good, yes, yes, good. Maybe, hopefully. All right, I'm gonna keep rolling. Hopefully you can hear me. Now you can, awesome. All right, so I don't know where you heard me from, if you heard any of that. Uh, did you hear me from the beginning? Um, all right, you heard me in the beginning, all right, so message of the day is grace and uh, we don't have grace in our lives for ourselves and for those around us um, we constantly have crazy expectations for ourselves and for the people around us and we don't give anyone the benefit of the doubt we don't give ourselves the benefit of the doubt and uh, we uh, we push ourselves really hard and to the point where we burn ourselves out and we burn out the people around us um, Sunday, Sunday grace, um, so we'll bring you to church a little bit, listen to little Joel this morning, and, uh, he's talking about how God has a plan for us, uh, and everyone around us, and we need to live in the moment, have grace, and know that God has a plan, and accept that God has a plan, and live our lives right, live our lives in the right direction, and just trust in God that the plan is in play and we just keep having faith because we try to force the hand of God force the situations that maybe aren't ready yet maybe we're not ready to go to that level yet maybe um, there's a different reason different door that needs to open um, we try to force a lot of things in our lives um, I'm guilty of that myself um, whether it's a, a relationship uh, that's not working out whether it's a, a business situation that's not working out whether, you know, friendship that's not working out, whether it's a, a lifestyle that's not working out. Um, we need to do what is right. We need to represent winning, as I like to say. We need to have faith in God and, and share the love with everyone around us. And just just live in a moment and just have grace and don't get so, um, so caught up in, in driving and, and striving. Um, yeah, we gotta, we gotta do the right thing every day. We gotta do what's right. We gotta push to some extent, but it can't take over our lives. It can't take over everything we do. We need to, you know, enjoy lives and enjoy where we are in life. And um, Joel has a uh, sermon about um, blooming where you're planted. Um, if you're planted in a field full of weeds, you need to be the flower blooming in the middle of the weeds. Um, we need to 
almost accept where we are and live in the moment and be the best we can be in that moment. And that's how we'll grow and have the faith in God that there's a plan. Um, sometimes God has us helping others around us. So we may not be in that level yet because we're in this level to help the people around us. Uh, that's something else he explained that, you know, it's not always about us. God works through us. So at times we may be helping the people around us grow while we're waiting for our time. Um, just super important. Um, grace, Sunday grace. Um, have grace in your life. It's not all about the strive. It's about living your life, enjoying life, enjoying those around you and <laughs> living your best life representing God, representing winning, and uh, do the right thing every day. So that's the message. Um, hope that makes sense to you. Uh, it does for me. I know uh, hearing that kind of <clears throat> gave me a little peace because um, I'm constantly pushing, constantly going, and uh, sometimes you just feel like you're not getting anywhere. And you got to be grateful for where you are. And uh, you know what? you got to look back and see where you came from. I've come a long way in the last couple of years of different things in my life, and I'm grateful for that. And uh, we have to have gratitude and be happy where we are. All right, everyone. So there's your message. Let's jump in prayers. We got a beautiful sun. Sun's already risen. It's late. And uh, here we go. All right. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us all to have grace in our lives. Help us to understand that uh, you have a plan for us. And help us to be grateful for everything that you've done in our lives and continue to do in our lives. And help us to have faith that... Uh, you will open doors when we're ready and you will bring people into our lives when we're ready and to help us to stop the chase and stop the, the forcing the situations to help us to just have grace and have peace and uh, and love amen so there's your message there's your prayers sunday fun day i hope everyone's doing something fun we got some real estate ventures going on this afternoon some house showing some walkthroughs uh got a closing tomorrow um we got uh Center's going into contract. Um, basically, everything I got is in contract. So uh, I need some new listings and uh, work with some buyers, trying to find out some stuff. Not much inventory. We talk again. If you're thinking about buying or selling, um, now's the time, man. This market is still crazy. Um, who knows when it's going to end? But um, there's no inventory. There's lots of buyers. Rates are still good. Um, if you're thinking of making a move, talk to me. I'm happy to help. We got. Uh, you want to buy a house um, yeah Dawn has Glenhead that's a great house uh, just under a million up in Glenhead nice big home great area uh, that one uh, that was ready to move so we had an open house last weekend it was uh, I don't know almost two dozen people through the open house uh, lots of interest in that one um, yeah not much inventory out there so if you're thinking of selling it's a great time it's a great time we'll get your house sold quick for top dollar if you're thinking about buying, um, come work with me. I'm still getting my offers accepted. We talk about this all the time. Uh, we build this business on relationships, on real estate built on relationships. And through all those relationships I have out in the world, uh, we work with other agents and listing agents, and uh, we get your offers accepted. So um, if you're not working with the right agent and you're not getting your offers accepted and you're trying to do it on your own, don't. I'm here to help. It's the biggest investment of your life. Don't do it alone. If you needed heart surgery, you wouldn't go out and nickel and dime and find the cheapest guy out there. You'd get the best person and you'd get it done. So just like buying a house or selling a house, it's the biggest investment in your life. It's probably the most um, most money, you, you know, most whatever equity you have, um, you'll ever have in your life for most people. Uh, don't trust it to uh, someone that doesn't know what they're doing and don't try and do it alone. Uh, when you work with me as a, a buyer's agent, I get paid through the sellers. It doesn't cost you any money. So if you're trying to buy a house on your own, it's completely crazy. I work for you for free and uh, I'll get you off for accept and I'll make sure you get the right house and I'll make sure you have the right attorney, the right home inspector, uh, the right mortgage people, the right title people. Um, I have a network that you get when you work with me. So if you're out there trying to work on your own, that's completely crazy. Uh, it's free for me to help you buy a house. 
tell my team for my team to help you buy a house um, so that's definitely crazy to do that and again if you're listing your house um, again my records stand for themselves when you list with me you get a dozen agents working for you for the same price as one me and my team so if you're looking to sell a house I'm happy to help we get houses sold fast for top dollars make the process go smooth we help you get through all the hurdles. We help you get through building department issues and whatever other stuff that shows up when you're selling a house. Um, we have the contacts, obviously have a contracting background and uh, I make a lot of stuff happen. There's a lot more to just put a sign on your house and selling it. Um, so let us help you with the process. This is what we do and uh, we'll make it fun, make it enjoyable, make it easy for you. Hi everyone, there's my commercial for the day. Happy Sunday. Um, if you need anything in life and real estate and whatever, reach out to me. I'm happy to help. I'm a connector. I love connecting my friends uh, with whatever they need. And uh, I love listening to your stories and helping you uh, get unstuck in your life um, and help you grow, help you enjoy life, help you live life. I've been there. I've experienced it. I got 45 years of life of mistakes and wins. And uh, I can help you shrink some time in your life and make your life better. So we enjoy getting out of bed before the alarm every morning. Put your head on a pillow every night knowing you made the world a better place. Fire starts fire. Go inspire someone in your life to be better. God bless everyone. Happy Sunday. It's a beautiful sunny day. Get outside and enjoy it. Everyone, God bless.